What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Nikolai Espresso, and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. Today with this one, we're going to be taking a look at some mod tools and some gameplay here of a custom map. Before we get too far into it, I want to let you guys know I'm doing a giveaway with a bunch of other YouTube friends here. We're giving away Battlefield 1, Infinite Warfare's Legacy Edition, a tub of G Fuel, as well as a pair of control freaks. That link is down there in the description below if you want to check that out, as well as if you may find some creators that you may actually fall in love with. But you remember Daku Dragon, the guy that we've been actually keeping an update with you guys on his progress on his map called Radtown. This one actually is a lot closer to complete than we've seen it previously. There's a lot of different assets added in, a lot more functionality, and it absolutely looks brilliant. So I wanted to feature this here for you guys today up on the channel, showcase a little bit of this for you guys. And with that said, make sure you go check him out. His YouTube link will be down there in the description below as well as his Twitter link. And with that said, let's just talk about this map in itself. Now, the mod tools are once again in the alpha stage as we've mentioned previously, so not everybody has access to it. It's a very select few that actually do, but with that said, they are some of the most talented in the business. They got the early access for a reason, and they're showcasing off what they can do, and honestly, I think it looks brilliant even in the very early stages. As you guys know, there's not too many assets that are still available to it. There are some assets for zombies and some for multiplayer, but there's still a very limited amount of resources they can use, and with that said, they've made some beautiful things. Now, as you'll see around in this gameplay, there's a bunch of different central locations. There's the bridge, there's the stream, there's all the houses, and the houses look so cool to me, I think. It plays on the futuristic aspect of the game, but it also plays into a more sci-fi version of the game as well. There's a very cool underground stream that there's a tunnel with that as well. There's a bunch of different spots to wall run in the back of the map, and this thing is just absolutely beautiful, and it had to have taken so much time to get anywhere near completion because as you can see this thing as he explores around a little bit more is absolutely massive like this is crazy this might be a little bit too big to see something normally in black ops 3 but for all intents and purposes it's absolutely brilliant it shows off the power of mod tools it shows off the power of just how much you can actually do with this and when it comes to a full state in black ops 3 pc it's gonna do wonders for the community it's gonna give so much content so much availability for new stuff and it is just absolutely insane i'm super hyped to see the mod tools come to black ops 3 pc i don't think it's gonna be anytime before dlc 4 i have my own theory with why and i'll do a video on that actually very soon here but I think it's gonna come out a little bit later than DLC 4, but at that point in time, I think I'm gonna pick up a copy of Black Ops 3 on PC because it is just so promising. Now, this map itself is still in early access in terms of the development that he wants to do with it, not only for the fact that it's only in the alpha state of mod tools, but he plans to do so much more with this, and I think that that is absolutely nuts. Like, this thing looks crazy cool to begin with, and then add in the fact that this is still nowhere near completion, that is just absolutely insane to me. But I think that's where we're going to wrap this one up here today, ladies and gentlemen. I just wanted to showcase this gameplay here for you guys. Once again, go check out Daku. His YouTube and Twitter links will be down there in the description below. So make sure you go check him out, show him some love. But I would love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. Are you guys hyped for Mod Tools? And if so, are you going to be picking up Black Ops 3 PC if you do not already own it once Mod Tools are released? I'd love to hear your thoughts down there in the comment section down below. But if you guys did like the video, be sure to like rating down below. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. By the time this goes up, I might already be at 40,000 once again, but if not, well then we're on the road to 40 or 50,000. I don't know which one just yet, but thank you dude so much for watching. Thank you for the support. I'll see you guys later. Take care and peace.